Hey guys, and in this video I'm gonna show you two of the new sequencers from Civil uh, to Ally. Hope you pronounce it well. Uh, so uh, nothing very new and special, but a user interface is kind of worth to look at. So the first one is Tepper, and we have um, eight step sequencers with a one trick. So you can just uh, imply some triggers and make each step to skip uh, because of the incoming triggers. So it works like that. So you inject some clock. Uh, it starts uh, switching uh, the steps for example, and then you can apply some multi-trigger source. I prefer a clock divider. Um, we have awesome one from uh, Holonic. Let's take uh, the similar clock output and provide triggers to the sequencer. All right, and let's apply a reset to both of them and reset them. So you can hear there are no more actual eight step sequencer, but a random amount of steps because of clock dividers controlling the module on practice, it sounds like. Let's apply Atelier palette and provides the output and the trigger as well and we need some quantizer for this one so let's take let's take rewind quantizer like that choose some scale and here we go Faster clock. You can hear uh, such inconsistent in incoming CV output. Let's switch uh, the range. slower clock to see some legata abilities or uh, make it even more musical with a uh, will slap like that let's apply some delay Locked. Let's apply input and output for AUX buses and apply the send. Let's apply faster delay time. Like that. Apply the same CV output for modulation. For feedback as well. So you can hear actually um, pretty semi random but well controlled sequencer with clock divider. And of course, the thing about I like in the gaps is uh, division mode. This can definitely change the behavior. And here is a switch, it changed behavior when the um, divider is applying. Maybe 
the faster clock will make th more sense. At least fast. Something like that. Uh, of course, you can apply um, more uh, trigger, multi trigger source to control this um, stepper. One of them is, of course, Bernoulli gate. For example, if you want to make some more straightforward sequence. And you have uh, this clock. You can apply some switch to Zen. And probably it happens sometimes, probably not. Sometimes it's switching over the steps. But if you want more random you can apply clocked random gates. OK, and connect, for example, this clock source sources. Well, let's apply faster division for that. So the second sequencer is NHRVLC and it's exactly a fug uh, has a fugue machine behavior so or rhythmicon behavior so you can apply different clocks and or one clock and divide them by some uh, divisions so for example and we've got uh, internal quantization. Let's apply same scale as for the previous synth. Yes, yeah, so you can control it with the different clocks, each row. And you can apply different amount of lens as well. And here is a stuck intervals. Uh, I don't know what it means exactly because no manual is available yet, but I believe it um, uh, relates to the quantization uh, feature. Okay, let's copy this palette and we'll apply poly output to that. And we're gonna produce some chords. If we change pitches here. Uh, this sequencer doesn't provide uh, some poly polyphonic sum of incoming clocks so you can make various things about that you can connect external trigger Let's apply 
there's some delay as well. Some special. Let's take a lower octave in there. scales A minor of course I actually like uh, this chords uh, with a slower gait it has some liquid atmosphere Of course, again, you can change uh, the source of the clocks to the different, uh, whatever you like, destinations. With the clock random gates, it also sounds pretty cool. Let's implement the slower clock so you can get the slower chord implementations it's pretty minimalistic tool for creating compositions in this rec Let's set a reverb, since we have a that kind of uh, chord atmosphere, I don't know. Longer decay. Let's cut out high. Set some filter, for example, uh, the new one from Vult, it calls Nitros, okay. It has a uh, crazy resonance knob, be aware about that. sequence so sometimes it will play, will play lower sometimes higher of course we need some slew limiter for multiple purpose I prefer this one Of the chord, 
the same service as uh, for the court to our uh, lead sequence. So in this way, with these new sequencers, you can make such a beautiful uh, landscapes of sound uh, because they are all based on connecting um, source uh, that you like to perform. And for me, it's clocked random gates, obviously, because you get notes you want to hear and take the random triggers and here's some long instability in the patch. So thank you for watching guys. Uh, this module is not in this, are not in this library yet. So I just build, get the builds and upload my Patreon so everyone can uh, take them from the page. Uh, link in the description below. Uh, hopefully they are, will in library soon. And also you can get the patch on Patreon as well. So thank you for watching guys and see you next time.